Audrey is one of the people I focus on in the book, and she happened to be an asylum seeker. She and her family had been through the Rwandan genocide. But the remarkable thing about her is that despite what she suffered in Rwanda and the atrocities that were done to family members of hers before her eyes and to her, she was dragged away before her family, raped in front of her family, and hauled off to a camp to be brainwashed by the members of the Hutu tribe that that attacked her family at a funeral, unfortunately. She managed to escape after being wounded, and she ran through the night into Uganda. The things she saw and she lived through and suffered through were enough to make anybody sort of just fall apart forever. But the thing about Audrey and so many other people I've been just so privileged to get to know and to work with is that eventually she made it to the United States and we worked really, really hard. And she would say over and over again that if she could survive this and get through this process, that she was going to devote her life to helping other people. 